Every gamer has their weapon of choice, but sometimes you just don't have the right one. And that moment is the time for an upgrade with some cool gear to become a master. So this is Cooler Master. Take it with you and make it yours. Hey what's up guys I'll be here and you must have heard the saying that once you go click clack you never go back and that's why I have partnered with Cooler Master to bring you guys this video. We have a foolproof gear upgrade for any of you gamer out there at a pretty good price point. This isn't a review by any means, this is just merely my experience with the products and how I feel about them. And if you want me to do a full in-depth review of any of the product mentioned in this video, then do let me know in the comment section down below and I will surely try to make a full review as well. But with that said, let's get started. So in general, I mean you are getting almost everything in this package to get started with gaming. And this whole setup costs less than 9000, roughly 130 US dollars and you are getting some quality stuff right here with the big promise of a brand like Cooler Master. So you can be sure that you aren't compromising with quality here. I have been using a CM Storm keyboard personally from past 2 years even before I started YouTube and I still love that thing to my heart. But we aren't here to talk about me so let's jump on to the gear. So first up we have the basic necessities that is the keyboard and mouse and here we have the ms120 keyboard and mouse combo which at the price of roughly 6k or around 89 us dollars impressed me a hell lot the keyboard has mem mechanical clicky switches and that clicky in the title does stand true as they are even more clicky than my cherry mx red switches as they compare with the cherry mx blue switches and that's because of the four element build up with the spring and custom plunger in order to make that clicky sound but except all the technicalities these do a pretty good job at emulating a mechanical feel and you don't have to apply much pressure to register the keystroke it's all about a light press and that matters a lot to me as coming from a proper mechanical keyboard so pretty impressed overall and before we jump on to this fancy rgb glory it's finally the moment you guys have been waiting for here is a sound test I hope that pleased your ears and now it's time to please your eyeballs. So take those out and stick to the screen. So this is one hell of a keyboard for lighting effects as MS120 features perky RGB illumination but you have to stick with the key combos to change those and it can't be done via software but I think it is still a fair deal looking at the price of the product. As you can see all the function keys acts as the control for lighting and it has quite a lot of effects like the rain effect, reactive touch and you can adjust the speed and direction of the effect as well. And that's not it if you want static colors this can do that as well and you can get to your desired color by changing the RGB values with these keys. The build quality is pretty good as well and on back we have the adjustable razors along with UV coated keycaps which are compatible with Cherry MX switches as well. So ultimately this is one of the best keyboard for RGB lovers on a budget according to me and it is a pretty solid choice to go along with. But everyone needs a partner equally good to him. So the bundled mouse here also doesn't lag behind as it is pretty ergonomic and targeted towards right hand users. The clicks are satisfactory and provide a good feedback plus the side buttons are super clicky and the scroll wheel is great as well. It also has RGB lighting which can be changed via the combination of DPI switcher and the back key. The mouse has 4 adjustable DPI levels that cycle between 500, 750, 1500 and 3500 respectively. According to me this was the only place they could have improved as I would have liked the scaling a bit more closer as sometimes they are pretty far from each other and there is nothing in between but this ain't a major problem and I'm super happy with this mouse as the tracking is superb and it feels great and premium while using. And in conclusion I would definitely recommend this MS120 combo set to everyone and if you want to check out my review of the Cooler Master Master Mouse Lite S then here is a card. But we are now done with the combo set and we land upon the Master Pulse MS320 gaming headset because good audio is very important.
designed for good gaming experience. So this is an entry level headset targeted towards beginner gamers and costs around 3k or about 39 US dollars and I will not take much time of yours in this and we'll get straight on to the experience. So the sound quality is pretty decent but the highs and mids do sound a bit muffled sometimes whereas the low ends have a punch which I personally like so the bass heads will love this headphone but your opinion may differ. Even though I would have liked a more crispier sound but I think it will get improved with the upcoming headsets. The build is good and these are comfortable to wear and I really like the top headband which is nicely padded along with the ear cushions which covers the whole ear providing a good seal overall. There are a couple of things that could have been improved though like this metal headband portion as if you accidentally hits it it does affect the sound and you can hear it while using and the second thing is the microphone. It is pretty good but could have been better but it gets the job done for voice chats. So here is a sample so that you can have have an idea for yourself. The cable is pretty long and we have the volume controls and the mute switch right here on this dongle. So this portion of the video is being recorded by the MH320 gaming headset and the microphone is just a centimeters away from my mouth and this should give you a rough idea of how the microphone sounds. Overall gaming with this gear was an absolute fantastic experience and I really enjoyed it even though there is some room for improvement here and there but I think Kulu Master is surely going to hear the gamer's voice and work upon it. And if you want to get any of the stuff mentioned in this video then check out the links in the description. And that's about it guys for this video and I hope you enjoyed it and if you did then drop a like and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. And this is Avi signing off.